Hi, I'm Xuan Weima, uh, and English name is Ada, from the Advanced Innovation Center for Future Education, Beijing Nam University. I'm responsible for international cooperative research projects. So the Advanced Innovation Center for Future Education is a high-level uh, international research organization. Also, it is committed to promoting uh, the transformation of Beijing's uh, public education service and through integrating digital and smart technologies. Uh, so Smart Learning Partner Platform uh, with an acronym of SLP platform. And this platform is based on uh, big data and artificial intelligence technology developed by the center. It aims to provide online services to primary and middle school students in Beijing and to help them doing online assessment and also personalized learning. And the platform will generate report after the students doing assessment online and to give them uh, personalized guidance so that will help the students to uh, improve their learning with the precision, like the data mm -hmm. or statistics. The teachers in their class cannot pay attention to each student because in China, for each class, maybe it has uh, more than 40 or 50 students. So, and the teachers need to take care of more than three classes normally. Yeah, for a for grade. SLP actually nowadays is mainly aimed for students in primary and middle school students. And the students can use this platform after class. And actually nowadays, we want to integrate this platform into teaching like the uh, curriculum teaching that teachers can mm -hmm. use it in their class. Because apart from this platform and it also has a function and it's called online and offline teaching service actually it's online teaching service so uh, teachers can use this platform to do like online tutoring to students when they need help so students can also make an appointment with a teacher and then they can chat online and as actually this platform has web and and also students can download like an app uh, in their smartphones so they can use a, 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 in either way the first challenge i think is from the technical part because to run such a, a good or such a big platform uh, we need a large number of staff or uh, technical staff to do the technical support that's why we keep recruiting and you know, to keep, rec to, uh, keep recruiting like the technical expertise. And the other challenge is that because this center is supported by the government, and so we need to uh, coordinate between the government, the school, and the center, and also uh, the teachers, etc. So there are a lot of coordination work to do, and to also satisfy different needs from different parties. The theme of the conference is on um, personalized learning. Yeah, as it, the title says, one app for all. The answer is definitely no, right? And I think for the future education, it is must be characterized by personalized learning and supported by technology. So I think only harnessing the power of technology can make the personalized learning dream come true mm -hmm. and also it is a long way to go um, but I think with the internet plus uh, with the technology support mm -hmm. uh, and also with the uh, teamwork from different walks of life like uh, experts teachers and students researchers and I think the technical like the expertise, etc. So uh, we can make the personalized learning or teaching and education more available and efficient and effective.